All right, let's switch gears as the high school baseball playoffs began this week. They do so with a pitching ace who's literally been unbeatable in his high school career. But as St. Pius senior Cole Stewart continues to rack up the victories on the mound, he also remains a big-time football prospect. More on Cole in this week's Sports Zone Spotlight, presented by Subaru. As the St. Pius Panthers opened the postseason playoffs, all eyes were on pitcher Cole Stewart. And so were the radar guns. With a fastball that's already been clocked in the mid-90s, Stewart is rated by most as the top pitching prospect in the country. Big League scouts come out in full force whenever Cole's on the hill. It is what it is. I try to zone them out. I try to I try not to think about it as much as I can, but you know, I try to just play my game and be a part of my team and play my role and then kind of just move on from there. Cole's the kind of guy that thrives on it. He really likes the uh, he likes to have the ball. He likes to have uh, it's not the attention, but it's the uh, the want to win. You know, again, uh, pressure situations. He wants to be the guy hitting, or he wants to be the guy on the mound uh, winning the game for the team. He really is a very mature and humble 18-year-old. So he's handling it because. That's just who he is and, and what he's about. And he understands that it's part of the bigger picture of the reality of his life. You know, he still has tests and he still drives his brother and sister to school every day and he comes home and cleans his room and, you know, he does what every other kid does. And then on top of that, there's this circus that's going on. In a brilliant varsity career at St. Pius, Cole has yet to lose a game, owning a perfect 22-0 record. But while he's projected to be a first round pick in the upcoming Major League Draft, there's more to this story than baseball. Cole is also one of the nation's top quarterback prospects, throwing for nearly 9,000 yards and 66 touchdowns in his varsity career at St. Pius. And as a diehard and lifelong Texas Aggies fan, Cole has signed to play college football for Texas A&M. For as long as I can remember, I've been at every Yankee game that's been at home that I can get to. The day that I was offered, it was probably one of the most surreal things that ever happened to me. I mean, I can't, I couldn't imagine. I mean, I was the, literally the not, weekend before I was in their stadium, just yelling my butt off for them. And then the next weekend they call me and tell me to get up there. And I mean, it was just, I'm a, I'm a lucky kid, you know. I mean, I'm just, I've been blessed. I've worked hard, and you know, a lot of it's paying off. So. But as a projected high first round pick in baseball, there's a different sort of payoff to consider. One that could be worth millions of dollars if Cole opts to go the baseball route right out of high school. I'm having to make a decision that, you know, a grown man would never even have to make and I'm 18 years old. So I definitely, my dad, and my mom, and you know, other people in my life that have gone through things like that. Um, it's, it is a big decision and it's gonna be hard. and. Uh, but I think that if you allow God to come into your life, and I think he'll, I think there's a path that he, you know, wants me to take, and he'll, he'll make that decision for me. What do you think he's gonna do? <laughs> really? <laughs> Honestly, I don't know. His life has a plan. I've seen God's hand on him since he was a small child. I've seen the role that diabetes has played in his life. I've seen the role that he's played here at St. Pius as a leader and, and all the things that he's done, and there is a bigger plan for him. Cole's most immediate plan is to try and lead St. Pius to a second straight state baseball championship. Whether he'll be firing strikes or touchdown passes afterwards remains to be seen.